Look, look, look. Welcome back to CBS 2 News at 9 a.m. Time for this week's Furry Friend Finder when we help a four-legged friend find a forever home. Sandra DeFeo, the executive director at the Humane Society of New York, joins us this morning. And we have Isabella. Yes, this is Isabella. Isn't she great? <laughs> She's great. I know she wants to say hi to you, okay, John. <laughs> Cindy. So first off, I love the breed. Explain to Cindy the breed. Yes. Well, um, we are calling her a Frenchton mm -hmm. because she's a Boston Terrier mixed with a French Bulldog. Oh my goodness. We decided, you know, because she has the longer legs uh -huh. like the Boston Terrier and then the, you know, the face like the French Bulldog, but she doesn't have that round bowling ball body mm -hmm. that they do have. Um, and she has a good nose. She can breathe well. Oh, that's good. Good eyes. <laughs> you. She's two face. years old. Yep, she's two years old. And is she, I mean, have any medical issues? What kind of family are you looking for? Well, um, we're looking for a family probably with older children because okay. we're concerned that sometimes she doesn't act well with little children. Okay. Um, and dogs, she likes dogs, but okay. it's dog by dog. You know, we'd mm -hmm. have to see if the two dogs got along. And um, but she's really playful and mm -hmm. fun and sweet and housebroken. That is a big thing. <laughs> she is an amazing dog. And look at she knows she's on a single shot. Yeah. So she's going to give you the nice full profile. Aww. Look at this dog. And I like Aww. what you were saying. And I'm going to get you in big trouble. Sometimes French Bulldogs are not known as being the most intelligent breed, but the but she's bred she's with a Boston a, a, a and little smarter. She's smart, all right. She takes in everything, looks at everything. She really gets it. And how much does she weigh? Twenty pounds. Okay, that and that'll be it. An she's two years. And she's old. full grown. Full grown. Oh, how, what's the energy level of these dogs? Well, uh, it, it you know she gets very excited and playful, and then she's very chill. Yeah. So <laughs> she can be very quiet and relaxed and just observe everything that's going on or she can get very involved and like she did with everybody here running around and chasing perfect for an apartment yeah. though yes she could be a good great one. size mm -hmm. dog too. yeah definitely we love her is we she love the her. Best? she is <laughs> she is all right we have a furry friend finder update as john steals the dog <laughs> we have a beautiful husky balto is home oh good look at balto he now lives in brooklyn with rochelle and jay and balto loves giving his new family kisses meeting other dogs and kids in the neighborhood on his walks and sleeping in his owner's big bed. His daily brushes make him happy as well. So yay for Balto. And then Isabella, I'm sure we're going to have an update on her very, very soon. And the heat, we have to take it seriously for yeah. pets. Yes, very seriously. Um, don't have your pet out in the middle of the day, especially tomorrow is going to be very bad. Brutal. Yeah. yeah, so early morning walks um, when it's cooler. If they're older or younger or have an illness, you have to be super careful. Yeah. Just get them out, let them do their thing, and then bring them back in. If they're wee wee pad train just keep them inside yeah right mm -hmm. Sandra thank you so much yeah she gets shy when you talk about wee wee pads <laughs> for more information on furry friend finder head to our website cbsnewyork.com we'll be right back